Hello, welcome back. This is Steve of Bugs Coins and welcome to the channel. We're going to do a hunt today. It's an animal coin hunt and I've designated this coin hunt ACH18. The first coin that we have here is a bimetallic. The obverse here shows the Queen. It shows the year of 1996. It is a $2 coin from Canada. On the rear we have, across the top, let me get it back into focus, there you go, you have the name of the country which is Canada, you have the valuation which is two dollars, and in the centre we have a polar bear. This 1996 coin had a mintage of 375,483,000. That's quite a mintage. The next two coins are both the same coin. They're five forints from Hungary. One is from the year 2015 and one is from the year 2017. On the one side you have the value, on the other side you have the white egret. Of the country and the year. The mintage for the 2015 five forums is 46 million 15,510. For the 2017 version the mintage was 35 million 3,510. Next coin is a South African coin. There you have the cash of South Africa, the country and the year on the on the subverse side and on the reverse we have an antelope and the value. This 1989 coin to this 1989 two rand South African coin has a mintage of 65 put up 65 million oh. Next coin is from Ireland or Ira Ira. It's 1982 one penny. On this side we have the harp and the country and the year of 1982. On the other side we have the stylized bird from the Book of Kells and the value of 1p. The mintage of this 1982 coin was 54,189,000. This coin is the new newer South African design for 5 cents from 2004. You have the coat of arms and the year on this side and on the reverse we have the value of five cents plus the crane. This 2004 coin has a mintage of 534,176,000. Next we have the two smallest coins on this coin hunt. There are one cent coin from South Africa, one is from 1996, the second is from 1993. On the South African one where it shows you the coat of arms and you'll get the year and the country on that side. On this side we have the value plus the two little birds which are Cape Sparrows. The 1993 version has a mintage of 178 million. The 1996 version has a mintage of 255 million. This next one is from Australia. It's a one cent coin from 1969. 
On this side we have the Her Majesty the Queen and the country and on this one we have the possum with the valuation of one cent. This 1969 coin has a mintage of 87 million 680 thousand. This next one is also has the Queen as the uh, obverse design. It's from 1976, it's a one cent coin from Bermuda. On the reverse of this coin we have a one cent denomination in written in text. You have the year of 1976 and you also have the animal is the boar or the wild boar. The mintage for this 1976 one cent is one million uh, one million. Next we have another coin which has the queen as it's on its obverse. You've got the year and the country there. It's from the Isle of Man. It's a 1p from 1980. It has an AB mint mark and it has the Manx cat as its animal on the coin. I could not find a mintage for this coin and not that I mark available. Next one is a another portrait of Her Majesty the Queen but this one is on a two cent from Australia from 1996. You have the Queen and the year on this side and then on the reverse you have the value and the animal is a frilled lizard. This 1966 coin has a mintage of 217,735,000. Please excuse me, my I'm going to Qatar today. This next coin is from Norway. It has a monogram crown of Olaf V. It is a two or, two or coin from 1960. On this side, having got the crown monogram on that side, you have the value of two or, which is on the right hand side of the coin here. You have the country name and the year, and you have a bird here, and that bird is a black grouse. The mintage for this coin is 3,735,000. The next coin is from Italy. It's an aluminium coin and it shows a rudder on this one side and the name of the country. It's from 1954. As I said, it is aluminium. You have the value on this side, you have the Rome mint mark, you have the year and you have the dolphin, which is the animal. The mintage for this 1954 coin is 436 million 400,000. Next we have two coins of the same value, one is from 2008 and one is from 2006. They're Canadian five cents. You have the Queen on the obverse in both cases and then on the reverse you have the year, the country, the value and the animal and the animal is a beaver of course. The 2006 version of this coin has a mintage of 43 million and 8,000. The 2008 mintage is 220. The 2008 version of this coin has a mintage of 278,530,000. Just give me a second, please. Sorry about that. The next coin. It's from Australia, it's, two th it's a two, sorry, it's a five cent coin from 2006. On this, on this obverse you have the, crown, uh, the portrait of Her Majesty. And on the reverse you have the year, sorry, on here you also have the year, year and country. On the reverse you have the five cent 
in inside the uh, rolled up version of the short big Achinda. The mintage for this 2006 coin is 306,528,000. In Chinda, a Chinda is spelt E C H I N D A. This next coin is from the reign of George VI. There you have the in the imperial crown. And this coin is a half shilling or 50 cents coin from 1948. You have George VI as I said in the in Emperor's crown and on the back you have the country's name of East Africa, the year, the value and the and the a line in front of a range of mountains. This 49, this 1948 coin which is has a value of half a shilling or 50 cents has a mintage of 7,290,000. This next coin is a Polish coin. It's actually an aluminium coin and it's a one slotty from 1974. You have the eagle and the country on this side then on the other side which is the animal of course and then on the other side you just have the value of one slotty the mintage for this 1974 coin is 42 million. And this last coin in the animal coin hunt is from Cyprus. It is a 5 cent or 5 mils coin from 1987. On this side you have the coat of arms of the country and you have the year. On the reverse you have a a monument that's held in Nicosia Museum. It's a portrait of a ram. I'm not sure whether it is a cave painting of some description that has been uh, that the Nicosia Museum has. The mintage for this coin for 1987 is five million coins. Ooh. This this coin set has now been bagged up, ready for me to flip and organise into my collection. Once I've done that, I'll upload to New Mister, and if I have any spare coins, I will be letting people know. In the meantime, if you enjoyed this video, if you can give me the thumbs up, that would be absolutely fantastic. Whoops, let's just widen it out a little bit. If you give me a thumbs up, it's absolutely fantastic. If you haven't yet subscribed and you believe I deserve it, if you could hit the subscription button as well, I'll be delighted to have you along for the rest of my journey through coins and banknotes. I'm trying to grow my channel this year, and your thumbs up, uh, your liking the videos, and also, also if you've been subscribed, will help with the algorithm that puts me in front of other people who will then hopefully again will then uh, subscribe to the channel. I do four videos a week so hopefully you can find something that you'd like. For this video uh, I'd like to end by thanking you all for watching and from me until we meet up again on this channel, which I hope will be not too long into the distant future. From me, bye bye now. Ta da! Bye bye!